Romania, where questions about Comey are sure to come up. CBS 2's Susanna Song is live in the control room with more. Hi, Susanna. Hey, good morning, Aaron. Comey's testimony has lawmakers divided over whether the president actually violated the law. Those were lies, plain and simple. Ousted FBI Director James Comey spoke candidly for almost three hours Thursday, accusing President Trump and his administration of defamation and lies. I was honestly concerned that he might lie about the nature of our meeting, and so I thought it really important to document. Speaking before the Senate Intelligence Committee, Comey said he began keeping memos on his so-called inappropriate interactions with the president, particularly one during which Comey claims Mr. Trump asked him to drop the investigation into former National Security Advisor Michael Flynn. He did not direct you to let it go. I took it as a direction. Comey admitted he later asked a friend and professor at Columbia University to leak the contents of that memo to a reporter. The president's personal attorney said Comey's actions should be investigated. Mr. Comey has now admitted that he is one of these leakers. Do you believe the president obstructed justice at all or that there's any evidence of that? I do not believe there is. Was what the president did appropriate? Uh, I just don't see how anybody can look at the facts and say yes. Comey would not say whether he thought President Trump obstructed justice, but the president's lawyer says he feels completely vindicated. Well, Comey's testimony also raises questions about Attorney General Jeff Sessions, who recused himself from ongoing Russia investigations back in March.